Hello guys, it's Radek from European Coffee Trip and I just got back from Bucharest. So in this little video I will show you, I will not show you, I will tell you about this natural Bolivian coffee and also what happened at Colab Bucharest. First things first, so last week I was visiting Bucharest together with Caro. Caro is our senior editor of the European Coffee Trip, the magazine part. Hello, we're at the Barista Gala of Europe's uh, collab uh, event in Bucharest and we're following the talks and also workshops today, the whole day, here at Arca. And I met there many coffee people. One of them is Alexander Nikolai, who's the 2016 World Coffee Roasting Champion. He also gave me this bag. He was really excited about this naturally processed Bolivian coffee, so I'm gonna brew it now. So every time I brew coffee in the office, I like to use V60. And I usually start with 15 grams of coffee, 250 grams of water, 30 seconds bloom with 30 grams of water. So the coffee is ready and I have to say that I don't usually come across the Bolivian coffee. Although I'm not a big fan of naturally processed coffees, so I really enjoy this one because there's lots of sweetness, the aroma is not overwhelming, there are notes of tropical fruits and the body is medium high, that's what I like. Thank you Alex for the coffee and I guess now let's talk about the collab, what happened. So we are just passing Arcap, which is the venue for a collab. There were all the presentations, workshops. So what is collab? Collab is a three-day event full of talks, workshops, community events. It's organized by Barista Guild of Europe and we as European Coffee Trip we participated as a media partners and also we were recording all the talks for Barista Guild of Europe YouTube channel. So later on you can watch all the talks from this event on their YouTube channel. Well, actually, you have a space for telling their own stories and experiences themselves. It also works empowering. Hello, we already saw two talks and we're coming to the third one just after the coffee break. Stay tuned. This is my total harvest last year. There's one coffee chair. And so you joined all the workshops. Which yeah. one was your favorite? I think my favorite was the Nicaraguan uh, farmer stock. Yeah, it was really interesting to see what's actually happening at the farm and what are they struggling with and um, what other roles women have at the farm level, which was really inspiring. The Bucharest coffee scene is blooming so fast and it was great to visit Bucharest after three years and actually see the difference. So if I can recommend one place, one city to travel for coffee, Bucharest might be the place. So thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, smash the like button, subscribe and we'll see you next week. Bye bye.